All right, guys, day two at the Burbank Card Show. Staying with some family, uh, so I'm a little far away from the show, but look at this. Not too bad of accommodations. I'll take this. I'm, I'm missing out on some trade nights, but the vibes are definitely immaculate out here. And Tazzy out on the dock. Look, we even have a special guest with us coming to the show. Feeling uh, good just to be in Southern California again. Yeah, first big card show. Uh, what are we thinking? For the card show, let's just say I'm excited to go to Disneyland after. There I'm kidding, go. I'm kidding, I'm excited. <laughs> All right, just got a huge deal done with Beak's card. I appreciate you. First time setting up. Yep. How's First it going time. so far? I love it. I completely overwhelmed and uh, glad I did it. For yeah. You. It's a great experience. Well, I got some really cool stuff. What stood out to me uh, immediately was just some like, this was when I started collecting. Like, Troy Smith was my guy, Vernon Davis. Where'd my, there's a, there's a Dwayne Jarrett in here somewhere that was. It's well, a thick oh, right there. This is the one. He told me he had a sick Dwayne Jarrett. Had to get it done. Johnny Manziel, that's a beauty, but got a great deal done. I'm really, really happy with this stuff. Thanks again for the deal, I appreciate man. you. Appreciate Thank it. you. Did you sell anything yet? No. Oh, wait, <laughs> yes. What'd you sell? I sold uh, four dollar box cards, but I sold it for three dollars. Well done, master negotiator. What what questions were you asked as well? I'm curious. Are you buying? Okay. Immediately. No. Yep. <laughs> uh, unmarked card. What are you asking for that? No clue. <laughs> what do you want for it? <laughs> like, what do you want it for? Someone asked for my PayPal too. Oh, I just guessed on that. Well, first I pulled up my Venmo, and then I was like, this feels. Oh, wrong. they Venmoed you for three dollars. Well, oh. no check your phone because then I pulled up your phone number and I was like, oh, you can do it this way. There you go. First deal of day two, VIP rips. Breezy breaks. There it is. Getting rid of some of the... A little soccer here, what do we got? This is sick. Yeah, you sometimes you get to swipe in on whatnot when a new product comes out and then um, after a couple drinks. <laughs> you said it was Sunday League too who was pushing you Yeah, in yeah, Sunday, Sunday League, um, they actually DM'd me to get into their select uh, Serie A break because they knew I was chasing him. Yeah. And they forced me to waste my life savings on their breaks. Yep. And now I'm poor and I sold it for like 20 bucks to, to <laughs> That's Troy. the circle. Sunday league breaks and then try 415 cash out. This, this is like, yeah, and it's like a fourth of my original investment. <laughs> so we're getting scammed. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate it. Okay, we're going to play a little prank on the Gamble Gamble Boys. <laughs> <laughs> your mouth is oh <laughs> I can't think of you two. It's like a stage drum. He's like, <gasps> Go ahead. We're on limited okay. time. I have this card valued probably a little under $100. I'm going to walk up to them and I'm going to say that I was doing a challenge for Troy and I bought it for $500 to see how they react because it's not worth that at all. Hi, guys. Introduce yourself. Hey guys, I'm Joe uh, from the Gamble Gamble crew. You can call me Joe Gamble Gamble. This Joe Gamble Gamble is one of my favorite people in the hobby. <laughs> <laughs> He's just the best. Anyway, I appreciate that. Thank I you. am okay. So Troy sent me out with like a lot okay. of money. A lot of money. Wow. To, <laughs> to buy a car. Okay. Um, I don't know anything. I wasn't allowed to look at comps. Like okay. I just kind of trusted people. Okay. And, uh oh. <laughs> I feel like I messed up. Okay. Okay. I this is a ten. It is a ten. Justin feels like it's like really good. Yeah, he's good. He's good. Yeah. I bought this for five hundred. No. 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 No, you're fucking with me. Sorry, mess up. They... Sorry, mess up. They're over there. <laughs> Seriously? Like, are you fucking with me or is it? And I'm dead is it like, can we pause the video? Can you, and dead you're dead ass? ass. <laughs> okay. What should I do? Troy, you're gonna be so mad. How much it worth? <laughs> I, I think it's worth like 80 bucks. <laughs> I'm you. <laughs> you better be fucking with me. Cause I, I was about to be like, we need to shut this off and I'm gonna take you over there and we're gonna fucking. <laughs> We're gonna press these dudes. Like, what the? <laughs> she said she bought this card for five hundred dollars. <laughs> Alrighty, well we have you here. We got a little break. We're at the table. We're gonna do a guess the price challenge. We're gonna see how good your card knowledge is. Okay. What do you think? I think since the last video, I've learned just a little bit more. So I'm ready. All right, we're gonna do. I think basketball is more in your comfort zone. So we're gonna do basketball. Let's do it. I didn't. Hurry, yeah. 
or the Kobe. Okay, they're done? Yep. Okay, so 15 out of how many? 15. Oh, that's just the card number. <laughs> that's okay, not. Cut. Cut that. Okay. Go on. I think I forgot everything I learned. Okay. This is a PSA 10 and a 9. Kobe and a Steph. I feel like I'm just going to go This off. is going to be a long segment. No, I'm sorry. How do you know how many of these there are? How do you know how many there are? Those aren't numbered. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. But you got, we have, we have what year it's made. We have the player. We have the sets. I think the Kobe's more expensive. One for one. This is probably like somewhere around $100. That's probably like a $60 card. All right. So I'm we trying have... to think of other content to share with you guys. Um... Well done. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> Let me say this. No, no, no. Let me say this. Okay. Troy left me for like 45 minutes just sitting here alone at the table with no knowledge. But you're a smart girl. Like, that's what I'm saying. I, I thought you'd be able well, to... Well, some of his stuff isn't, like, priced. I can't pull up eBay and, like... I, I'm not going to be like... You You know how to do it. I'm not going to be like, let me see what the comps are. Like, you could. I'm not... I'm, you're I, negotiating. It's all about negotiating. If there's anything you've learned about sports cards, it's not about knowledge. I just asked you 15 out of how many on a non-numbered card. That's true. Well, here you go. All right, now you got three. Anyway, I was convinced that Troy was, like, around filming me. And it was like a prank. She was being pranked. It was like punk. But it wasn't a prank. He was just off buying cards. All right. You got three cards here. Okay. So we got James Wood, Bowman's Best Auto, PSA 10. John Morant, NT Auto. Daniel Jones, Contenders, Rookie Auto. Which of these is worth? We got basketball, football, and baseball. So okay, we're really they're testing. all autos. This one's the most expensive. You saw the price tag. I saw it earlier. <laughs> I have to know my inventory. Apparently you didn't. I was like, yeah. But you know National Treasures. Okay, yes. well now you do. National Treasures is usually, it's a very, it's one of the top sets. Alrighty, one last, <laughs> our first, we haven't done, have we ever done a, no, we've we're maybe done like one deal together ever. Yeah, this is our second, but this is our first big deal yes, right here. first deal. And look at what we picked up. Topps Chrome 2017. Interesting, like, the comps are weird, right? And this is kind of what I was explaining with you too. Like, someone might come along and pay huge for this Mueller, yep, yep. but I've seen the comps. If we auction this, um, even this Dybala, this could go for like 35 bucks <laughs> at auction. Yeah. But I think we both talked about it. The raw is where a lot of the upside is because we can grade this stuff and it'll do well. So, I don't know. It's it's a good deal, bro. It's uh, a good yeah. deal. I'm, it's going to be a, a lot of work, but it's going to be worth it. So. Yeah, our, our downside is limited. We, we kind of paid, we didn't really pay like full comps. We kind of paid a number per slab and per raw card. Yeah. So I'm, I'm happy with it. We're all pumped. We're I'm pumped. It's pumped. Just, just for the mems. We did a group deal. We love it. All right, guys, that's a wrap. Hope you did enjoy. If you didn't, make sure to like and subscribe. See you next time. Peace.